Ho, ho. Merry Christmas. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's Young, and I am bringing you a special video. This is the second part of my Christmas special. My gift to my subscribers and to uh, anybody who watches my channel. I'm posting up two videos uh, for Christmas because, like I said, I am in the giving mood. And uh, if you see my first video, hopefully you clicked on it. If not, I'll put the link in the description. But that was me running around with the sniper rifle, the MSR, doing a little bit of quick scoping. Uh, this right here is a special gameplay right here. Uh, I'm running the specialist strike package. And I'm running with the P90 silence. And uh, it, it gets it gets really good. Uh, but no spoilers. Let's... um. Let's talk a little bit about Christmas. How many of you guys celebrate Christmas or what do you celebrate? Kwanzaa, um, and what else is there? Uh, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Happy Holidays, all that stuff. Uh, I, I um, uh, celebrate Christmas. Me and my wife are going to go to her in-laws to probably eat some good food and share some gifts and stuff like that. And uh, me and her, we already know what, you know, we got each other for Christmas. It's no big deal about being no, you know, surprise or nothing. So I'm actually getting Battlefield 3 on uh, on the PS3. So um, if you play Battlefield, man, please hit me up because I'm going to be brand new to it. I'm not going to know what I'm doing. I'm going to be a Christmas noob on Battlefield 3, which uh, is, a, is a funny story, man. On the other day on Twitter... I was hitting up NASA one. Um, if you if you don't know who NASA is, please look him up. He's a beast commentator. Rushes primarily plays a lot of different games, PC and Xbox. Um, but yeah, he's a beast. And uh, I, I I hit him up on Twitter saying, "Yo, NASA, I don't want to be a um, I don't want to be a Battlefield Three Christmas noob. Can you do a a noob setup video?" And he actually retweeted me a lot that night and uh, replied back and said he'll try to do it. So. If he does, I'm looking forward to that. You know, I like NASA's videos a lot, man. He's a, he's a funny guy, and uh, his videos are always good. But um, yeah, man. I'm so I'm trying to get ready for for Battlefield because, you know, I've, I've been Call of Duty spoiled. Uh, you know, I like fast twitch shooters like this. Battlefield's gonna be a little bit more slower paced, a little bit more strategic, and I'm ready to play a game like that. It's just that. You know I'm not used to it, so I just feel like I'm gonna jump on and and uh, you know just get owned. But it'll only take a while to get everything going. You know I'm not I'm not dumb. I'm not an idiot, and um, I definitely don't suck at these games. So it's gonna be something that I can pick up. I pre-fire this guy around the wall. That UAV sweep is so slow. If you see a guy coming, don't wait on the UAV sweep to try to let you know where he's at because that thing is so slow. By the time he gets there, he'll probably be shooting at you already. And you're looking up at your map like, damn, what the fuck? So I pre-fire now. Just something you got to do to cut the BS from this game, you know? You got to do as much as you can to cut the BS that you can cut. But you're going to get BS sometimes. That's just how the game works. This game, that is. That's how this game works um, most of the time. So I do what I can to cut the BS. And uh, that's pre-firing around walls and shit like that when you got a UAV up. So just do what you got to do, yo. But, um, yeah, other than the Battlefield 3 thing, man, I, I really want to get into some parties with that because I just, I'm, I'm going to have to be babied. <laughs> I'm going to have to be babied around. But that's all right because I'm new to the game. So that's, that's what just has to happen. But again, like I said, I'm running the P90 in this, and I'm going to say that the P90, I first used it when the game first came out, and I thought it was beast because I was using assault rifles at first. When I switched to this, it felt like I was moving so much faster, and you do move faster with the SMGs, especially when you get a specialist bonus. It seems like you're running with lightweight then. So I switched to this in the very beginning, like within the first two weeks that the game came out. I was having success, but... I don't know why I went away from it. I put a silencer on it and I just couldn't use it. So after that, I started using the MP7 and I use the PP90 a lot. But I'm going to say with the submachine guns that 
I'm gonna say the PP90 is the number one submachine gun, and this is my opinion. I'm gonna say the P90 is gonna be behind it. And then I'm gonna say the MP7 closely behind it. And I'm running around here with C4 too, man. Um, C4 is very fun to use. I haven't used it a lot in the previous Call of Duty games, but it's very fun. Oh, I almost died right here from this dude. He's playing tactically. He's not camping. He's playing tactically, hiding behind the, you know, the trash can or the car, the flipped over car to try to head glitch me. But I'm on a specialist bonus. I'm moving fast as hell. He can't, he can't, he can't catch me right now. So I just run away from his bullets. Come around this corner, and this is the thing about having a specialist bonus. You see those guys because I have marksmen, and it helps me out here because. I get the Moab, get my Moab here, P90 Moab rushing around, and it's funny because right when I got the Moab, man, I got these couple kills after, and these dudes just straight rage quit, the game ended, and we got kicked out to the lobby, so hope you enjoyed this Christmas video, man, P90 Moab, a lot more to come from my channel, check the other video if you haven't seen it, uh, everybody have a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and stay tuned to my channel. And y'all be easy.